I started babysitting to pay the bills in between acting jobs, and it's great, you know, waiting for my big break. Oh, and some of these kids are really well connected, so I just sort of think of it as a networking opportunity. Does that look okay? Yeah, it's fine. I'm a babysitting prodigy. You know, I was a 10-year-old babysitter. I started out babysitting my dolls. The next step, of course, was goldfish, larger animals, and then humans. I take my job very seriously. I'm responsible for a human life. It's my first time working with the Arnolds. Today I have to take care of Jimmy while his mother is taking care of his grandmother's funeral arrangements. Hi Jimmy, I'm Betsy. How are you? Jimmy? My nan is dead. I'm sorry. You know, sometimes it helps to turn your loss into art. Would you like to make a painting? No. Okay. Well, if you need someone to talk to, I'm here. Maybe I could use a hug. Come here. I've been babysitting for Dylan for a really long time now. He's actually sort of a collaborator of mine. Ever since Dylan discovered the joys of YouTube, I've sort of been his main backup singer. He's hoping we'll go viral. I think I'm really connecting with Jimmy. going through a lot of emotions, also hormones. <laughs> At least he's smiling. You look good. I know. I told Dylan that an agent gets 10% of any job they get you, so he sort of made it his personal mission to get me discovered. And he wants 20. Why aren't you wearing any makeup? I am, Dylan. I'm trying to look natural on camera. Natural is different than washed out, Dana. Ugh, your hair. You don't like it? I was trying something new. Whatever. We'll just put a wig on you. Ew. That one is perfect. Of course I think Jimmy's a cute kid. I, I mean, he'll be cute when he grows up. He'll be an attractive man one day. Uh, what are you trying to make me say? We can't use that. We have to do it again. Again, this time with full out facials. I know I could do better. D do you think I could pick the song this time? All right, Dana. Show me something. Good night, Jimmy. Do you need anything? How about a bedtime story? <sighs> My nanny used to read to me. Just one book. Well, aren't we a little overdramatic?